hello friends welcome to my youtube channel today i will discuss about the syllabus of git biotechnology 2017 so git 2017 will be conducted by indian institute of technology turkey let's come to the syllabus the whole syllabus of biotechnology is divided into three parts general aptitude engineering mathematics and core biotechnology so first let us discuss about engineering mathematics so this is the syllabus the important parts are matrix and determinants eigen value eigen vector differentiability differential equations first order and higher order laplace transformation probability and statistics so previous year they have asked 19 sorry 14 marks from this so if your mathematics is good or you have time to study mathematics and go for it if you don't have time then study the important parts like matrix and determinants eigen value laplace transformation and uh, probability and statistics if you will study this thing then also you can get 10 to 12 marks so let's come to the next part next part is general biotechnology so the first is biochemistry so important parts are enzyme kinetics pharmaceutical structure and action potential electron transport chain so from action potential and electron transport chain they ask some drug which are which are having some specific targets and then from enzyme kinetics they may give you graph and ask the kinetics of equation they may also give you numerical question from this so previous year they have asked 12 marks from biochemistry let's come to the next part microbiology so earlier microbiology was not so important for biotechnology but from few where they have they are asking some question previous year they have asked seven marks so the important is virus structure and classification bacteria structure and classification methods microbial growth and nutrition they may ask some numerical also from microbial growth that are very easy you should see that nitrogen fixation microbial disease and pathogen this is also important they will give you matching from one part they will give you microbes and second part they will give you some diseases you have to just match it we have said they have given seven marks so next part is cell biology so structure of of cell prokaryotic cell and eukaryotic cell cell cycle control these are very easy parts we have said they have given four marks from this welcome to next part molecular biology and genetics so important parts is replication transcription translation uh they will ask mostly from prokaryotic because eukaryotic is a little tough so don't go for the typical pathways in eukaryotic system if you have some basic concept also then also you can answer the question gene interaction complementation linkage recombination chromosomal mapping so these are also important plasmids are important you will get in this thing in rdt also so this part is is important previously they have asked uh nine marks from this part so this is important next is analytical technique analytical technique is very important if you know the basic concept then also you can get 6 marks 6 to 8 marks so previous year it was 6 marks before previous year in 2015 they have given 8 mark question from this part next is immunology immunology is also very important you they may ask three question of two marks one or two question of one marks so important part is mhc and basic concept like innate and adaptive immunology cell mediated immunology immune system 
Vidigeri combination. Previously they have asked previous and before that also they have asked question from this part antigen monoclonal antibody hypersensitivity autoimmunity. So these are important. So previously they have asked five marks. Next part is bioinformatics. Bioinformatics is very important. But uh, earlier it, uh, in 2015 and 14 they have asked many questions like four to five marks. But previous year they have given only one marks. So you should study. Don't think that they have given marks one mark. So we should not study this. This is important. This is easy also. They will give some straightforward questions. If you know answer, you will answer that. Next part is recombinant DNA technology. Very important part for biotechnology. Previous year they have given seven marks. So important parts are. I, I can't say the most important part they will give some application based question so you should study the concept of this from that you should have some figure in mind so that you can answer those question yeah some easy question will be also come but usually they give two marks question and those are analytical type the next part is plant and animal biotechnology so previously they have given five marks these are also important in a future video i will tell you the books or from where you can study this stuff next is bioprocessing and process biotechnology so this is very important very very important every year they will ask approximately 20 marks from this part and uh, one thing I want to tell you, if you don't know bioprocess engineering and process biotechnology and mathematics, so you should not give kid biotechnology. You should go for get life science and choose their subjects. Like there are many subjects, biochemistry, microbiology, botany, zoology. So you should go for that. Because if you don't know mathematics and bioprocess engineering, you will lose approximately approximately 35 to 40 marks. So this is the syllabus of Get Biotechnology in the next video I will tell you syllabus of life science so thank you so much